What's up, YouTube? Are you interested in Ridge's new tool offerings? Have you been scouring YouTube and the interwebs for reviews on their new product offerings? Are you looking for information on their new lithium-ion technology and their new brushless technology? Well, today, we pull the covers off on the best tools that Rigid has to offer right now. So, if this is your first time to the channel, you might not know that the very cool guys at times has been a little harsh on Rigid. If you haven't seen the review, that we did on our one and a half horsepower compact router, we'll link that here for you to take a look at. You might ask yourself, hey Vince, why is it still in the box? You know, didn't you use it? Yeah, I used it. And I put it back where it belongs, in the box. I didn't feel right about returning it, being that I used it, but I have other brands that I prefer to use. Let's not talk about what's in here. It might have scarred me for the rigid product line forever, but uh, we, could, we could do this on at another time. So a lot of people ask me, hey Vince, do you own any Rigid tools? What do you think of their product offerings? And I think because of those experiences that I've had in the past, I've kind of shied away from their new technology. I do like some of their older technology. I'm very fond of it. I know that Rigid, I've, I use their tools, plumbing tools, pipe wrenches and such. They're awesome, second to none. But there is one product line that I use all the time Matter of fact, I own multiple units and I use it so much that I don't even think about it. And why is that? Because it's not a glamorous tool. It's not, it doesn't have extra runtime and brushless motors and oh, all this, it's shiny and oh, all this gadgetry. It's something that I use, I depend on, it does a great job, I don't even have to think about it. Hence, when people ask me, do you use rigid tools? A lot of times I'll say no. I'll tell them, oh, unless it's a pipe wrench, I don't use rigid tools. But that's a lie. Vince has been lying to everybody. I do use rigid tools on almost every job. And here they are. I know it's not glamorous, but this is the best rigid tool ever made. It's rigid vacuum line. They're inexpensive, they're dependable, they have lots of options. You have brushes and extra pipe lengths, different nozzles. You can actually outfit this with a bag so you're not just depending on your filter for dust collection. If you add a bag and a HEPA filter, you have an amazing dust collection solution. Some of these units on special will only be 60 bucks. I think some of the top offerings are only $200. And those, those are metal units comparable to original shop vacs from 20 years ago. These are great products. They're solid. They do an awesome job. Also, if you need to get some air moving on a job site, you need paint to dry quicker, you need joint compound to dry faster, you get some air circulating in that space, it speeds your job up and helps you make more money. These units are inexpensive. They move a ton of CFM. They have wheels. They roll. They have a collapsible handle that helps them, you know, transport. I mean, this is a great product offering. So the next time you ask me, do you use rigid tools? And I say no, say, Vince, you're a liar. You depend on rigid tools all the time to make a living, because it's the truth. If you like this video, make sure you smoosh that like button. That's our new thing. We're gonna be smooshing the like button around here. Just kidding, not all the time. Smash that like button and share this video. Let everybody know you could depend on rigid tools to help you make a living and make it quicker. Thanks a lot. Have a great day, guys. Was that clickbaity enough for you guys? What about you? Did you like that video? Wondering what to watch next? Well, why don't you click over here and watch this video? Or click over here and watch this video. If you really like our content, we hope you consider getting subscribed by clicking right here. Thanks a lot, and have a great day, guys.